Kazakhstan politician assures that Russia is looking for a quote-unquote space ark buried in Ukraine, according to what he claims. This controversial and strange proclamation comes from Michael Sala, well-known Australian exopolitician and author. Dr. Michael Sala claims, exopolitics deals with the hypothetical political relationship between aliens and humans, which is based on the existence of terrestrial political relations with different cosmic races or intergalactic political travel. Along with the contactist part, it's one of the weakest links in ufology and therefore one of the stigmatic reasons that has kept academics and scientists away from the topic of such an important topic as UFOs. And behold, the exopolitical aspect could be not be missing in a geopolitical issue such as the current conflict between Russia and Ukraine that threatens to unleash the Third World War and even a nuclear apocalypse. According to Salah, the capture of the port city of Ukraine and the region oblast of Kherson by the Russian army not only responds to a strategic question, but an ancient space arc, quote-unquote, would be buried there, he claims. According to two independent sources, the space arc is buried under the Oleshki Sands National Nature Park, 46 degrees 35 minutes 19 uh, seconds north, and 33 degrees 03 minutes 01 degree uh, second east, which is only 25 kilometers or 15 miles east of Kherson. This space arc is said to be activating and it is predicted that it will eventually start to fly through the air, the Australian author writes on his website. Now, I don't know where he gets this information from. Salah assures us that the, this information was obtained from a military source whom he only identifies with the initials JP, who would have already been on covert missions on two other space arcs, he claims. One mission went to the moon and two others have been in Bermuda Triangle area of the Atlantic Ocean. Three, the three missions were carried out jointly by the US and China and the second mission in the Atlantic Ocean, including Russia, which had found its own arc but did not give the US access, he details. And it is that, according to his, his informants, this would not be a mere geopolitical invasion of Ukraine to avoid having NATO at the gates of Russia, but part of a quote-unquote cleansing operation, whatever that means and entails. The Ukrainian deep state was trying to activate the ark, which they have found many years ago, buried under the sands in the lower southern part of the country, he says. He says the ark was activated so that it was time for Putin to put it in his hands. There is a second ark in the north of Russia, but Putin already controls it, Salah said citing an archaeologist, Elena Danan, as a source. Yeah, we know it does not sound believable. However, one cannot deny that the story reads at least interesting, entertaining, not that much, above all considering the victims and refugees and destruction. More than a space arc, we hope that, for the good of all humanity, these two nations will soon find and activate peace and understanding. And this is on... Mysterious Society by Zach White. Please leave your comments. Thank you for your support. I support my Patreon account. The daily posts are five videos daily and they are totally different from what I have on my YouTube channel. Thank you so much for your support and that you find all my content so interesting. You'll find the Patreon account details in the description box below.